Yo, what's poppin' guys? Sizzle here. We're back on that comp deathmatch grind. Uh, I just want to mention every video from here on out for the Iron Man, the audio of me speaking is all post-recorded because I did all the remaining stuff when I was in a Discord call with people and uh, I don't know, I feel like that wouldn't have been great to listen to. So instead you can hear me, I don't know, rant about the game or something. I, I genuinely don't know. But yeah, we're on Kiriko this time. Uh, pretty straightforward character, you just hit the head. That's all you gotta do, and half the time you don't have to do that. But yeah. Uh, starts off with a nice, clean headshot on the Kree. Just like post-commentary, I, I don't know, is this just straight? I'm like a commentator? Starts off with a clean headshot on the Kree! Uh, fucking... <laughs> But yeah, Suzu's really strong for 1v1s. If I didn't suck, I would have been able to, like, headshot him or melee there. But whatever happens. Uh, it kind of is hard to commentate when I know I come out on top here eventually, but still. I like using the voice lines on Kiriko, because they're all very annoying. Uh, the, the one I use in my main is fucking Zamnen. It's like, Zamnen. Shit's really annoying when you spam it. Which makes it a very good voice line, because that's, you know, mainly what they're there for. Never seen anyone really use voice lines for anything else. I don't, I don't know why else they'd be in the game. It is interesting though. They said they planned on adding uh, more hero interactions to Overwatch or something. Like, the, like when you, you know, when Kiriko kills like Junkrat specifically, it'll be like a specific voice line for that. If you know what I mean. Uh, apparently, that's what they're planning on working on next or something like that. Which is, it's kind of interesting, but I don't really think it's all of that. Uh, anyway, got yeah. I mean, it's it's hard to commentate this stuff. There's not really a lot going on here. I don't know if it's better if I would have just left the raw footage and not said anything, but yeah. Uh, Kiriko is basically her whole thing in deathmatch. Is she's impossible to hit, but has a relatively easy time hitting other people. And especially if you hit heads, you can kill fast. Right? That's your whole gimmick on Kiriko. So you can basically just walk directly at people, and most of the time they're just going to miss their shots on you. The only problem is Reaper is really good, and, you know, if he's on a full 250, it takes two headshots and, like, a melee to get a kill. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, this other Kiriko 1v1-ing. The Chunkrat just coming out of nowhere, letting her get the finish. I think I would have had her, I'll be honest. I mean, the thing with Kiriko 1v1s always just comes down to random headshots and stuff. I think here I was tabbing out to check the audio or something. I come back and the Hans is standing right in front of me. I, I genuinely don't remember what I was doing. I recorded this yesterday. And I'm doing the audio a day later while I'm doing the editing, quote unquote, where I just cut everything together. The audio might even be decent because I played the recording after. But yeah, look at that. That's, that's a 100 ping moment right there with, uh, with the Suzu. I mean, I think I probably still would have died to Genji there, realistically. But the point is, I was going to use it to save myself. Look at that, just just dink the Reaper. If that Kiriko didn't show up, I think I would have had him with a body shot there. Kind of unlucky. But that's just how Deathmatch works. But yeah, I think this game is played in, in Plat 5-ish. Uh, so, you know, that's, that's something to guess, keep in mind. But also, the lobbies always have people from all over the place. Like, the guy in first probably is like Plat 2 or 1 or something. I don't think we had anyone I recognized from the top 500 leaderboard though. Most of those people kind of, you know, got their 50 games and then stopped playing because it's way too risky to play. I did almost manage to get Hanzo there. But, you know, we're still holding a, a decent second. And that Genji is kind of running away with the game. Hope he finished up early for us. That's uh, what I would say if it was live, but since it's not, uh, I, I know how it turns out. It's kind of weird. It's like I, I know the spoilers to a movie, but you ask me to, you know, do a play-by-play -play on the movie scenes. It's like, that's that's just rough. But yeah, I'm not very great with Kiriko. You can see I'm missing all these shots and whatnot, but whatever. Did enough that the Genji finished both of us, which that's good enough. We are in a very, it's a very narrow second. Like, we have like a one or two kill lead, so we're probably gonna get top four. The, you know, the goal here is to try to finish second. Bit unfortunate that Junker got away, but luckily he tried going back in, so we got a free kill there. I was spamming my voice line here uh, purely because I knew Genji was close, because I just saw him kill that guy around the corner. 
Uh, so I spam in the Kiriko voice line in the hopes that maybe he'll come over to me because he knows I'm close. Unfortunately, he didn't. Uh, but yeah, looking good here. Almost get that curry. The fact that that cleanse didn't like cleanse the nade is just a high ping moment. But yeah, we're cleaning up. Uh, I don't even know if I ever popped carry gold, actually, now that I think about it. Because I just don't know when you use it here. I think you should just kind of use it when you have it, and you're in any fight, because... You know, what, what else are you going to use it for? Very hard to intentionally use. I had to aim higher there. I wasn't aiming high enough to actually hit heads. That's unfortunate. You need to see, we got a nice second place tie. Because at 19, and he just needs one more. And, uh... Yeah, that Junkrat got us right at the end, but we still got uh, thirds, so that's good enough. Hope you guys enjoyed, see you in the next one.